everyone. We have a Character Kit 6 unboxing. So this is for people interested in the Character Kit and they want an example of a past Character Kit. So this one is now sold out. It's not giving away anything. So let's just get started with what is in here. This is the first kit we've done that had a uni style fit limited edition in it. I was really torn because if I do that, then I can't have it on the store because the idea really is that there are items that aren't on the store in the kit, like the majority or all of the items. And I think in every kit but one we've ever done, it was all totally character kit exclusive items. This, it was basically the second version of character kit six. So I'll try to explain what was different. So starting off, this was, this is probably my favorite thing in the kit actually. This is a Hello Kitty mono correction tape. I use correction tape all of the time and I thought this one was actually really pretty. So there's our Hello Kitty correction tape. We had Pikachu washi tape inside this one. Now this was one of the variants that was different depending on which kit you got. So some people got pink, uh, like the, I think pretty much same design but the background was pink instead of blue. So this is, this is the first Pokemon or Pikachu washi tape that I had ever come across. So I was excited to put it in the kit. We had, so here was the Unistyle fit in this one. So some people got a three color Unistyle fit, which also meant they got three refills instead of five refills. But they got the, the Unistyle fit three with, Rapunzel, I believe Rapunzel was on it. We do have a different, like, I think we have a Rapunzel four style barrel on our, I could be just totally wrong right now, so maybe I should stop talking, but if you're interested in a Rapunzel uni style fit, there is a different one that we sell that you can get online or on our store. And so then some people got this five color. This is Donald Duck with, Chippendale. Oh, it's all blurry, sorry. There he is. Wait, that's Chippendale, right? Yes. Oh, I'm very tired. Okay. I realize there are some people that might feel like, hey, I got a three color, and why did you give some people a five color? So allow me to explain. So, some people prefer the three color, some people prefer the five color, not just for the amount of colors that they need for color coding, but really for some people, it's a matter of the width of the barrel. You know, the three color is not as wide and some people don't like a wider barrel. So that's why I decided to do half the kits with a three color and half the kits with a five color because I wanted to mix it up and then there was just more chance that, I don't know, trying to please more people. but. But, so you did, if you got the five color bail, you did end up with two more refills than the people who got the three color. But there are limited edition refills also to fill your adorable uni style fit with. So I think I'll try to do more of this kind of thing in the future kits too. And then there was a Disney Pilot Juice. I have been just really loving Pilot Juice lately so I couldn't resist. And we did an Ariel Friction. Okay, so actually, some time ago, we did have this Ariel Friction on our store. We only, ha we had a small quantity, they sold out pretty quickly, and then they kept, Sunstar kept making her. So I ordered a whole batch of her for the kits. So that was maybe, you know, a very small chance that you would already own this. But every once in a while, we do make a decision like that just because we had, long after she originally sold out, we had people emailing us wanting her, and so that's why we decided she'd be a good kit item. 
And then we do love these Friction Ball Slim that are totally refillable. She came pre-filled with red, but you wouldn't have to keep red in her, obviously. Me, let me swatch her for you. Why not? Just do it right here. I love, if you're not familiar with friction, they're awesome. Totally erasable. All right, so I had to show that. And then a couple really cute notebook, notebooks. So this is a little notepad, Darth Vader and Son by Sunstar. Most of the stuff in the kits is by Sunstar. And two different scenes here. I love these little square notepads. They're really nice quality and hard to find in the US, especially these don't have the sticky, the sticky notes. And yeah, I actually find these little notepads so much easier to find in Japan than they are in the US. And so I like to include those in a lot of kits. And then this one is a little Sumiko Gudashi. Got some goobs on there. Um, this is a little Sumiko Gudashi like vinyl covered notebook and it's just cute. I just can't even stand it. So Sumiko Gurashi is by San X, not by Sanrio. And the San X is of course also a Japanese brand. And the funny thing about Sumiko Gurashi is, <laughs> so they, it was designed to, to kind of like represent those like odd things in life that make you feel cozy and comfortable, like the corner of a room. <laughs> I just feel like it's such a funny concept that it always makes me kind of laugh. But yeah, cute. And, and these came in different colors. So you maybe didn't necessarily get this like green colored one. But anyway, so yeah, those were the eight items. I counted the refills as one item instead of three or five, but those are basically the eight items in this kit. Hopefully that gives you an idea of the kinds of stuff to expect in the kits. I really do try to mix up the characters and I don't, I, Sometimes the kit will be like half a pretty strong character theme, but I don't think we will ever have a kit that's like just one character just because I, if a person, you know, it's a surprise what you get. And if a person had an aversion to that character, it would be super disappointing if every single item was that character. So we try not to do that. But anyway, let me know what kinds of characters and items you would like to see in future character kits. I really do keep your your interest into consideration when we're ordering for the kits. And also we are currently working on a non-character kit. So for those of you who are interested in character goods, there's gonna be a really cool non-character. It's just a more, it's like classy, elegant kit coming up. But what I can't decide is if it's going to be a surprise or not. So if you're interested in that kit, can you please let me know if you'd prefer surprise or not? And we might be able to think of a way to do it both ways. Like maybe the product on the website will not have pictures, but then if you want to see what's in it, you could go watch the video on YouTube or something. So we're trying to figure that out. So please let me know what your preference is because that'll help us figure out how to do that to please more people. Um, we always, always love your feedback. I uh, hope you have a wonderful day and happy writing. Bye-bye.